Hey guys, uh, this is Raj and uh, today I'm going to look at Automate app. It is available in Android and it is a free app. So this app is basically used to automate few tasks in your mobile. Uh, let's say uh, I want to uh, put my Wi-Fi off when I go out of my home or when I'm in my office I want to make the mobile profile as silent so we can automate that using this app and it's free so let's check uh, the app now by default when you open this app you will see that home wi-fi intruder photo and few other basic uh, profiles are already set up but today what i want to do is i want to create a new profile for me so here I can see a plus symbol just click on it and uh, what I most like about this uh, app was it is in, in a flowchart base if you see I have this box here and I can create more boxes down and create a flowchart based on that flowchart your profile or your uh, set will work so let's just edit this this is the beginning of the setup so let's say silent mode it just gave the title as silent mode now if you see down here there is a checkbox which says allow parallel launches for this plot but i don't want my profile or my set to run on parallel so I won't click on this I don't need this to set up as well so let's say done my first block is done uh, now I have to add the other connectivity part so not now what I am doing is when I when I am out of my home I want my mobile to be in silent mode so for that first I have to check that my uh, mobile is connected to Wi-Fi or you know uh, I can do that by using GPS location but the downside of using GPS is uh, it has to connect to internet to get your location and that depends if you are using your mobile data you will get charged by the operator and even it consumes the battery so I'm I'm not going to use that right now what I can do is I'll connect to my home, home Wi-Fi and if it is in the range then I'll set my mobile profile as normal if it is not in range I'll put, I'll put it as silent let's see how it goes so first of all I'll check for connectivity oh, there are plenty of options available here if you see from airplane mode to Bluetooth NFC USB Wi-Fi everything now what I am checking for right now is this Wi-Fi connected check if Wi-Fi is connected on an access point so select this now a new box appeared below the beginning go and open this one and set it up see this drop down here you have two values one says inter immediately and another is when changed so there is basically a difference between immediate and when change when you use when change that means the the setup which you are doing is only triggered when there is a change in the Wi-Fi network immediate means it will it will go on hitting the loop every time uh, it sees that uh, that you are in the Wi-Fi range you know it doesn't make sense you know if I am home for four hours I don't want my setup to run for four hours continuously so I'll go for when changed then I have to pick the network so this is my home network I'll pick it that's it done now I have two blocks it says when I'm connected to this what I have to do now now I have to make the profile as normal right so first close this block here you have settings right open the settings 
here you can see ringtone set ringtone get ringer mode ringer mode set right so now what we have to do is use this ringer mode set It is asking what profile I need to set. I said normal. When I am connected to my Wi-Fi, I should be normal mode. Done. And if I am not connected, then it should be in silent. So I will just copy this block again and paste it here. I will set this as silent. So our diagram is basically done. We need to connect it now. Select this OK and drag it on to IN. So now if you see we have connected the first block and the second block. But these two are still not connected to my Wi-Fi, right? So this to this, this to this. Now if you see, we have only connected it for one flow. That means if you start it, start the process, it will check, it will connect either this or this and it will end. There is no loop here, right? So we have to make it a loop. So from here, I will go back to in. That means every time it is set, it will again go back to checking Wi-Fi. That's why here for Wi-Fi I used when changed because it will it will it will check for uh, the connection and change the profile or change the ringer mode only when the Wi-Fi network has been changed. Otherwise, it won't. So now our connection is done. I'll say complete. Oops, I forgot to mention this. Uh, I need to add the title. Say Oops. See, now it has two buttons, one is start, one is stop. So, let's start. See, it's printing some logs here. See, Wi-Fi connected, it is checking Wi-Fi is connected or not. So, now, see this. We have Wi-Fi connected and my silent mode is off. If I, if I remove, means if I close my Wi-Fi, see that the silent mode is automatically on. Let's again enable my Wi-Fi. Once I connect to my Wi-Fi network, see that the silent mode is off. So do it again. See, it's on. Connect to your Wi-Fi. It's still not connected. See, it's still not connected to my Wi-Fi, it's still waiting. Again. Yeah. See, now it's connected to Wi-Fi and you can see that the silent mode is off. So, see here it has logged every details of it. And if you want to stop, you can stop it. If you want to make change, you can go in from here, you can edit it. and you can basically create many profiles similar to this i'm just working on it uh, this is my first uh, setup i'm trying to do more and i'll get back to you when i have few more uh, setups and uh, this is my first vi uh, youtube video and if you like this please give me a thumbs up and uh, please also suggest some changes what should i do what should i don't Basically, that's it. Thank you. Have a nice day.